The number of chocolate chips in an 18 ounce bag of chocolate chip cookies is approximately normally distributed with a mean of 1252, standard deviation of 129 chips. What is the probability that a randomly selected bag contains between 1100 and 1500 chocolate chips? So I really recommend that you draw these out first. So go ahead and draw them out with a mean of 1252, standard deviation of 129. And then go ahead and shave between 1100 and 1500, and then turn to StatCrunch. So recall, in StatCrunch, you're gonna go to Stat, Calculators, and go down to Normal. So you're gonna put the mean, standard deviation here. And then we're gonna to need to click the Between button, because it's between two values, and it's gonna be between 1100 and 1500. And just press Compute. And so there we go, we got 0.853, let's see what we got here four decimal places, so 0.8534. Okay, how about the B part? The probability that a randomly selected bag contains fewer than 1,100 chips. So fewer than 1,100, you know, click the standard, less than or equal to 1,100. And recall that with continuous distributions, the equal sign does not matter at all. Discrete, if we're doing binomial, then it does matter. Okay, so there we're at 0 0.1193. The probability that a bag contains more than 1175. Okay, so let's change this to greater than and then put in the number 1175. So 0.7247. And then the last one, I believe, a bag contains 1,000 chips is in the what percentile? Okay, so come over here and we're gonna put in 1,100, or sorry, 1,000. And let's go ahead and easier my brain if I go the other way. Round to the nearest integer. So this is the 2.5 percentile, or if I round that up, be the third percentile. Kind of a giveaway, right? It's the only number with an RD third percentile. So I hope that helps.